Ooh, welcome to Sip New Tech. I'm Alex. How you doing? I have the Huawei P10 right here, and I unboxed this on the channel a couple weeks ago. The full review will be out very soon. I'm working on that right now. But as a custom, before the review comes out, we normally take a look at some cases, some accessories. This is a little different because I normally all these case videos we normally do on the channel are from third-party manufacturers. This one is from the OEM. We're gonna take a look at two cases made by Huawei. Huawei cases and they're not as bad as you think they are so let's check them out right now so the first case to put on my beautiful blue Huawei P10 this awesome beautiful color is the included case from the box this case actually came with the phone in the box made by Huawei and I have to say I am pretty darn impressed with this cheap plastic case that they included uh, and <laughs> As far as cheap plastic cases like these, or at least frosted clear cases come, this is actually one of the better ones I've, I've used. You can buy ones on eBay that aren't even as good as this one, and this one came included with the phone. Uh, as you can see, easy to slip on, like most of these cases are. Uh, but one thing I really like about it is the feel. It's not slippery on the back. This is like a really hard plastic. Uh, it's not the TPU kind of rubbery ones. This is strictly a hard plastic case. Um, and there's a little bit of texture on the back, which is easier for you to grip. Uh, the cutouts are good. Simply, they leave a slot open for the power button and the value rockers, leave a slot open for the bottom, nothing on the top, on the side. They have a full window all the way across for the Leica cameras, which is a theme we're gonna see in the next case too. So basically, Huawei, cuts their cutout, their cutouts for their cases exactly the same, no matter what type of case. The next case we're taking a look at is something that took me a long time to get over here. Even though it's an official Huawei case, it took me forever to get this thing here. This is a mixture of cowhide leather and fabric. I've seen a case like this before, and that was made by Google for the Nexus 5X. It felt like an eternity ago, but that was only two years ago. And that fabric case sold by Google was expensive as heck but it was worth it. It was a great case, great looking case, and I've never had anything else like that before until this. I'm at that point in my life where I want something that looks professional, both in terms of my phone and also the case that accompanies it. I also want something that doesn't look too, that doesn't look too bland, like a black or clear TPU case. I want something that's business professional that I can put on a conference table, put on, my, on the table next to my laptop and people will look at it and they think that I'm professional looking. I look really young, but I'm actually pretty old, and I get that comment all the time. So, something like this definitely helps me out here. And the case, in, the, in this case, I've, I've, I can't tell you how many times I've put it on a conference table, and people look at it and go like, wow, that's an awesome case. They don't know what the hell the Huawei P10 is, but <laughs> they look at it and they're like, wow, that's an awesome case. What? The, where can I get that from my iPhone? I'm like, it's not for the iPhone, guys. This is for the Huawei P10. Uh, but I like it for certain reasons. Like, it's covered at the top, all the way at the top, all the way on the sides. A uh, little opening here for the power and the um, volume rockers. But on the very bottom, it is exposed for the headphone jack, the USB-C, and also the audio. And usually on these types of cases, they have the bottom and the top exposed. But the way they have this case made is they have the top uh, covered here, the top rim covered, because they let the camera window all the way through. And one thing I like about the Huawei P10 in terms of its design, I stated this in the unboxing video, but I really like the glass window, I guess. It's kind of like the Pixel, except much smaller than a Pixel. It's only the top strip of it. So the fact that they exposed it through this case all the way across, and they kept the Leica name right here, just adds to the whole business professional look that I'm talking about. The Leica cameras, I can't vouch for them. I can't say that they're better than other dual cameras without the Leica name, but just having the Leica name on there makes the phone seem much more professional. And I bet you that's what Huawei was doing with the Leica branding partnership. So one of my favorite cases out there ever. And once again, it's pretty ironic that one of my favorite cases was actually made by an OEM. You normally don't think of OEMs making good cases. Like, throwing cases usually are pretty bad. But 
once again, this this was actually a pretty darn good throw-in case. If you had to have a throw-in case, this is actually a really good one. I would actually go on and buy this one uh, from Amazon or something. So, yeah. Oh, ooh. Okay, outro music's playing. I gotta go. Once again, my name is Alex from Tech. These are awesome cases. Let me know what you guys think of these Huawei cases. What's your favorite OEM case, basically? I'll see you guys in the next video. If you like this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, hit the bell button below so that you don't miss a single video in the future. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!